Hi friends, this is Shivani here. Welcome to my channel Shivani Creations. Today I am showing you how to create this very attractive vintage shabby chic envelope with these beautiful handmade flowers. So you can just open the envelope like this and put your money inside this. So without any delay, let's get started. For this we need liquid glue, micro bead pearls, some glitter shimmer, foam pad, sponge dauber, vintage photo distressing, some archival inks, ball tool, groove golf tool, pattern paper, scissor, scoreboard, stencil and some dies. First I am taking this pattern paper which measures 10 and half by 7 inches. On 7 inch side I am scoring at 6 and 5 8 inches. Now rotate your paper and again score at 6 and 5 8 inches. Now on long side score at 3 inches and 7 inches so the scoring part is done now fold all the scored parts now I am cutting this portion This pattern paper is having 180 gsm thickness. Now fold these two flaps and I will connect it like this. So the basic envelope is ready. I am just punching the corners using my corner punching machine and rounding it. Now just paste it using glue. Also I am rounding the corners of the front tag. Now to tie this envelope I am using this white color silk thread and I am attaching it using liquid glue. Now I am taking my vintage distressing and distressing the edge of pattern paper. It will give you a very nice vintage look. Also distressing the other pattern papers and also the punched border. Now I am connecting all the pattern papers and punched border on the envelope.
so this is done now i'm taking this polka dot stencil this is from icraft and i'm distressing it again using vintage photo distress ink so you will get this beautiful polka dot pattern in the same way i am making the pattern on inside the envelope now i am taking my daisy flower dies and using my die cut machine i am die cutting on white color soft floral oriental paper so you will get this beautiful daisies in the same way we need two large two medium two small and two smallest flowers i have cut these flowers using same die cut set now using the yellow and orange archival ink i am coloring these flowers so on the half side i will color using yellow color and on other half side i will color it using orange color So repeat this for remaining flowers. So I have colored all the flowers and also embossed four of these. Now I will show you how to emboss these. For this I am taking my foam pad and these two groove golf tool. I am using one large and one medium golf tool. You can see some slots inside this. It will help you to make the texture on the flower petal. So for the bigger flower I am using large golf tool. you just need to push from the edge towards the center like this and it will curve the petal and also give very nice texture can you see this beautiful wrinkles on the petal so in the same way i will emboss whole flower and just rotate the flower backward and using the ball tool push in the center to make it a cuppy like shape now for the next small flower i am using small groove golf tool Again I am making the cup using the ball tool and distressing a little more So 
in the same way i will do with other flowers so all the flower shaping is done now i will connect all these flowers with each other to construct the big daisy flower so i'm starting from the larger to the smallest one Now in the center I am adding half cut pearl and also I am adding little more glue on this half cut pearl. And sprinkling some micro pearl beads on top of this. This is from Dress My Craft. Just tap the excess pearls on the paper and it will look like this. Isn't it pretty? Now on the petals, I am adding little more glue and sprinkling some sparkle dust on this. This sparkle dust is also from Dress My Craft. You can find all these things online very easily. Tap excess powder. And this is done. In the same way I have created two more flowers and look after drying the sparkling dust. It gives you very natural and sparkly look to the flower. Now I am taking this doily die cut out which I have already prepared. So first I am connecting this. If you can't find this die, you can just paste the doily, paper doily on this. Now I am attaching two of the flowers on this. Also I am adding some leaf cut out. This is also made using die cut. And now I am adding this special greeting sentiment which is stamped using black archival ink and this sentiment is from Tubby stamp set.
from the same die set i have created this small flowers so i am connecting these also and this swirl die cut out in the upper corner so see using die cuts you can create very attractive envelope or cards in just a few minutes and it also gives you very finished and perfect look now for the final touch i am adding these water droplets here and there you can also add sequences in the place of water droplets like this so the beautiful money envelope or shagun envelope is ready you can just put money inside this and gift it to your nearer ones and you can just close it by tying a knot using this silk thread so my project is done for today hope you enjoyed my video please subscribe my channel for more interesting videos and don't forget to click on bell icon for the latest updates and notifications thanks for watching see you next time bye